what's going on everybody i am back with another video and today i am bringing you guys a review of a 2018 chevrolet equinox lt now first before we get into anything else let's take a look of the outside because that's one of the main factors when you are choosing a car is how the car looks of course so let's begin this particular car is not actually my style but the equinox And one other thing that I did forget to mention is that you can actually make this car your own. It's actually for sale at North Park Chevrolet in Castroville, Texas. And the only reason why we even have this car right now to begin with is because my girlfriend, as you guys know, if you are keeping up with the videos, she bought her 2021 Camaro from there. But there was a bunch of paint issues and just issues with the car in general so currently right now they gave her this as a loaner car which is a perfect for me because it gave me a video to make but again if you want to make this car your own just be sure to check down in the description below i will link it there and of course if you click it and it's gone then you know the car's gone and sold now let's get into the next thing that we're going to look at the interior interior let's start off by looking at this steering wheel. <laughs> it's a pretty large steering wheel, but I mean, it's just a SUV at the end of the day with the Chevrolet bow tie right here. And these are the dials to have you switch pages on this little center instrument cluster thingy. And typically speaking, they're actually on this side, but on this car, they're on that side for whatever reason. And here is where you click to activate the voice controls or to end a call and then right here is your cruise control set buttons and then to turn off cruise control it does have a fairly nice screen here on the entertainment system you got anything you could ever want and it does have the wired you got to wire it somewhere it does have the wired apple carplay because i know the newer cars have wireless it does have wired apple carplay which would come up once you plug it in of course it has dual climate and you can turn on heated seats as well for the both sides you could sync up the air conditioner um degrees and then right here of course your defrost buttons this material is but it is actually kind of hard and not the most comfortable thing ever so you're very comfortable very large for if you got the kids or something or if you have a bunch of friends or family constantly riding in your car this would be almost perfect for them and the key fob that you get is one that i have seen to be standard on most chevrolet keys you got your lock your unlock this car does have remote start as well. And then if you click this twice, it opens up at the, the back. And then right here is your emergency alarm button. Speaking of the back, let's go look at how much room we got back there. There is a spare tire that comes in this car because I know a lot of cars just come with the tire inflator kit. But let's see back here there is a whole bunch of room to store anything and everything you could like perfect for getting the groceries or hauling anything you need really and it does have the automatic shutting door thing powering this car is a 1.5 liter turbo inline four cylinder engine in case anybody cares So I believe this is going to wrap up this video. But again, this vehicle is being offered at North Park Chevrolet as a certified pre-owned. So if that is something that you are wanting or something you're wanting to look into, 
maybe you need an SUV, you need a bigger car, you got some kids or something, we're not out here to judge. It's reasonably priced at, I believe, seventeen or $18,000. So if you're gonna finance, monthly payment shouldn't be too crazy. And if you enjoyed, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. I will be posting more videos more frequently soon. But until next time, I'll see you guys later. Now, I did forget to mention a few things. Number one, I do recommend this car. I would buy this car because a lot of people prefer a bigger car because they feel safer or secure, more secure in the event of an accident. I would feel pretty safe in this car if I happen to be in an accident. But of course, I don't want to be in an accident. Two, it has a small engine with a turbo in it. So the small engine helps with the gas mileage, but the turbo helps you feel like you're not literally walking. Like it's not the slowest thing in the world, but it's not fast at all. And three, there is a whole lot of space for friends and family. And say if you're going on a road trip, you can put all the luggage and suitcases and stuff in the back. So although what my girlfriend purchased was a Camaro, Although she purchased the Camaro, this is not the worst car to have as a loaner car. And again, you guys can make it yours by shopping at North Park Chevrolet. I'm not sponsored by them. I don't work for them or anything. I'm just saying you can go buy this car because someone might be in need. So I'm trying to pass it along. And again, if you guys enjoyed, just make sure to like, comment and subscribe. Peace. I'm here editing the video and I want to apologize for my energy and just the way I sound in general because my allergies is kicking my butt. So I sound very weird and awkward through most of this video. I do want to apologize. I hope that you guys are still watching the videos all the way through though. I appreciate you guys. Should be better soon.